Hello, welcome to Anson Griffin's Occasional Series and MATLAB Tutorials. Today I'm going to be looking at error trapping in functions. The first function that I wrote in the previous um, tutorial was quite simple and there was no attempt at error trapping. So we're going to look at error trapping today. So let's see what the function does. And we're going to see the name of the function that I wrote is myFact4. So you can see that when I write this function, or when I wrote it, it gives me the number of input arguments, the number of output arguments, and 1 factorial is 1, 2 factorial is 2, 3 factorial is 6, etc. So that's grand. Now let's try and recreate some errors that I made before. So uh, my fact minus 5, you cannot get a factorial of a negative number. So when I wrote the function, um, I got that error message to pop up. Input must be non-negative. Uh, some other error trapping that I wrote in my fact 4.3. You can only do it for integer numbers. So, and we get a suitable error message like that. And one other thing, and this, if we put in two inputs, now I wrote some error trapping for this. Um, now um, the function that I wrote, the line that I wrote doesn't actually execute because MATLAB intercepts it. But okay, but when we get to look at my function that I wrote, it would work in some earlier versions of MATLAB. I'm running MATLAB version 2009. Okay, so let's look at the function itself. You can see here, and um, there's only one input argument. That's my fact n. That's here, or the, and there's no output arguments. So disp, this, this, that's okay. So the number of input arguments is number to string of n argin. So there's only one input argument. And I also output it here, the number of output arguments. And how do you get that? That's n arg out. So number to string, you need that. You need to convert that number to string when using disp. This is the error checking here. If the number of arguments is less than one, that error message puts, puts up. Okay, if the number of arguments is greater than one, you get the error message here on line 13. Now, as I said before, uh, this will not execute on my one version 2009, but it would if you're running earlier versions, something like 2004, 2005. So MATLAB itself put in this error trapping function. Line 14, if I try to get my fact for minus five or minus seven or whatever, I get that error message. And here, if I, this is on line 17, I was trying to do some error trapping for a um, non-integer number. So how did I do that? Well, mat the MATLAB command floor, so the floor of 4.3 is four. So what we're doing was n not equal to the floor of a number. So four, if the number input was four, well then n is four and floor n is four. So they would be equal, but if I put in 4.3, 4.3 does not equal the floor 4.3. So we get the error message on line 18. Assuming all of that works, that we don't get any error checking, we get to line 22 and we do a loop. So if we did 4, we go from 1 to 4, and the command that does, you know, 1 factorial or 1 by 1, 1 by 2, 1 by 3, 1 by 4 is taken care of on line 26. So that's the MATLAB's own function. Okay, I hope this helps and I hope you got some benefit out of it. Thanks very much.